Hello. Yes, Joe Anderson has cost the Liverpool taxpayer tens of thousands of pounds. That's right. The spectacle, the pantomime and circus that unfolded in Liverpool city centre several hours ago, where, wait for it, four, that's right, four so-called frontline patriots disembarked from the train at Moorfields train station, were held outside Moorfields train station holding two Union Jacks, I've left a screenshot, surrounded by about a hundred coppers with the usual rent -a mob shouting obscenities and abuse and what they weren't going to do and all the usual stuff the uh, champions of free speech shout, the rent -a mob Now, Joe Anderson, Instead of you issuing a plea to the rent -a mob to stay away and not tie down the police and use valuable resources the police don't have due to cuts and let the police deal with the four frontline patriots you'll send them packing once they arrive at Moorfield train station. All you needed was a copper on duty, yeah lads, is your return tickets, bye. And no one would have been none the wiser, but that doesn't happen. Instead, Joe Anderson, you announce you're going to lead the rent -a mob now, given the police cuts, given the crime in the city at the moment, there's not a week goes by, there's not a murder, a stabbing or some other violent crime. Given the police cuts and the crime the police are struggling to deal with, which you would know more than anyone, instead of issuing a plea to save the police the time, effort and money and resources policing this and issue the, a plea to the rent a mob to stay away and the police will deal with it, you don't. You announce you're going to lead the rent -a mob and you would know, you would know more than anyone that that was going to tie the police down and use valuable resources the police don't have. You owe the people of Liverpool an apology and you need to resign because who's footing the bill for this? It's not you, it's the taxpayer. And regarding the rent -a mob that was led by the usual Alan Gibbons, you know what, Mr. Gibbons? If there was no racists or Nazis, you'd invent them. I bet you have nightmares about them. Same with you, Liam Thorpe, the Echo Reporter, and you, Joe Anderson, while I'm at it. I mean, I went down before and I parked my car uh, on Moorfields, and I just sat in it, I was watching it, and I said, Christ, how many coppers are here? What's this cost, the taxpayer? And like I've said, and you would know more than anyone, Mr. Anderson, there's not a week goes by, there's not a murder, a shooting, a stabbing, or some other violent crime. Yes, Mr. Anderson, you announce you're going to lead the, the rent -a mob knowing quite well it's going to use up valuable police time and resources. Shame on you, Joe Anderson. Okay, thank you.